What is going on guys, Rowmaster? And uh we are back guys, we are back. I've got my parts for my computer. This is actual footage that I am recording off my Elgato. So thank god we can get back to doing videos. Uh, there will be a video today and tomorrow and a uh, weekend. Uh, I'm going to plan something and then uh, Monday. Back to our regular schedule, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So um, today I thought we'd do a top speed build we never did in Forza Horizon 2, which is the uh, Tesla Model S P85D. I think it's the D. Let me check. Uh, Forza Vista. Stay right there. No, that's just a Tesla logo. And yeah, I think it's P85D. So uh, let's go uh, test drive this thing. We will go to Le Mans if I can find it. Yeah, oh, it's right here. Duh. And we'll go when it's daytime. To get the most grip, and uh, I'll see you guys when uh, I get there. All right, guys, we are back, and uh, let's put it in forward, first gear, and now uh, let's hear how this thing sounds. Um, I can't rev it. I can't rev it because it's electric. Oh. There is no sound, but, um, yeah, I think it'll do 165, just because electric batteries, uh, I, I don't know how fast they're capable of getting, getting to, so, uh, let's go in three, two, wait, I got it, three, two, one, go, very smooth start off the line, all right, a hundred, hundred and twenty-five, hundred thirty. It's really quiet. It's so weird. Oh, I forgot into your review. Okay, I can't shift. I can't shift. One sixty, one two, one sixty-three, one sixty-three. Come on. Seriously, that's like weak. We didn't even get to the that that's, that was the first corner right there. We barely got to it. All right, well, I don't see any reason to keep going. Well, there you go, guys. Tesla Model S P85D. One. 163 miles an hour. I was actually close. I said 165. So, yeah. One gear. We went uh, 163 miles an hour with uh, 18,000 RPMs. Cool. So, I'll see you guys when we get back to the um, garage. Alright, guys. We are back in the upgrade shop. Let's get started. First, uh, uh, let's see. We can do platform and handling, drivetrain, wheels, aero, and motor and battery. Ooh, let's do that first. It's only one thing. That gives us plus 275 horsepower. We start at 687, go all the way to 893 pounds for the torque. 898 horsepower. So, uh, that's pretty close to 300. I mean, nah, 300, 900. What am I thinking? So, I guess we're going backwards this time. From bump, ah, oh, we don't want that. No, nope, I want to see what the wing looks like on this car. Oh, we can go for the Tesla wing. That just adds stuff, so we're not going to do that. Uh, wheels and tires, tire compound, race. Because who doesn't want to race tires on their Tesla? And it's all-wheel drive, so do we really need... No, I don't think we do. Drivetrain. It's going to be like the shortest um, part of the video. No. Yeah. I don't know. The shortest time I've spent in a video upgrading. 
And we'll get those. So yeah, guys, I did get my um thing back. What's it called? Power supply. Thus bringing you this video. I'm so excited. Let me know what videos you guys want to see down in the comments down below. I'm thinking tomorrow another top speed build, and I'm gonna start uh, doing some reviews over the weekend. And uh, I'll have those ready probably by. Oh, I have one ready probably by Wednesday, hopefully. So uh, be on the lookout for that. Hopefully, yeah. I'm not making any promises. And uh, we're done with our upgrading. Yeah, all we can do is go to S class. All right, tune car. I've never tuned a, a Tesla before, so um, or any electric car for that matter. So let's see how this goes. A uh, uh, gearing. <laughs> that's great. Okay, that's gonna have to change. Um, I guess it's not all right. Uh, st I stand corrected. It's not gonna change. So um. Yeah. Top speed's the same. Uh, that kind of makes sense because, like, it all depends on the gearing. And I can't do anything to it. Oh my god. Camber, uh, whatever. Andy Rollbox make these soft. Springs, you can guys can soften the ride height all the way down. Damping, yeah, this works. This works. That works. Um, you know what? I think we're gonna put these up all the way, and this up all the way. Why is the back responsible for all the braking? I feel like the front should be, or both. So uh, let's do that, and uh, let's go back and add those arrow parts because if it'll get this top speed up, I really don't care what it looks like. I just wanted to get past what it did stock. All right, now what does it say it can do? Actually, we have to tune the uh, arrow now. All right, now it says 263. So let's go arrow, speed, and speed. Top speed is. I didn't change a thing. Are you kidding me? Oh, we're taking those off. Definitely taking those off. And I stand correct. This is like the longest time I've spent upgrading. We are at 4 minutes and 30 seconds. All right, well, uh, let's go to uh, Le Mans. I'll see you guys when we get there. All right, guys, we are back, and um, I'm just going to skip the sound test because, again, it's an electric car. It's got no sound. So uh, let's go in three, two, one, go. I'll admit, it does get faster off the line. I'll give it that. But if it only hits... 163. I'm gonna be mad or sad. I'm gonna be a sad panda, a sad racer. I'm gonna be a sad racer. 163. Come on, go more. I know you can do it. I know you want to. Come on. I blame Elon Musk, Muskinator, Musketeer, as Derek D would say. Alright, someone please explain to me in the comments what the point of building this up would be. Maybe for drag racing, quarter mile? I mean, it's got good acceleration, but you can't do anything with the tuning to make it accelerate even faster. So, uh, please, if you guys want to explain what you guys use it for in the comments, uh, let me know. I want to hear it. But uh, if you guys enjoyed this top speed build, leave a like down below. Comment what you guys want to see next. And uh, if you need, yeah, I'm not gonna turn into Tomcat. Uh, let me try that again. If you guys like the video, leave a like down below. Comment what you guys want to see next, and uh, don't forget to subscribe for more content. And uh, comment what cars you want to see for tomorrow's video. And uh, I will um, think about it.
I'll pick the, whichever one I feel like doing. So, uh, yeah, that's about it. I'll see you guys in the next one. See you on the track.